Lightroom has changed quite a bit over the past few years, and one of the most significant changes has been the incorporation of AI into their software. Funny thing is, most people still aren't aware these features even exist. So today, I'm going to walk you through all of the AI goodness Lightroom has to offer. These tools have personally sped up my workflow a lot and saved me countless hours editing weddings, so I know they'll do the same for you. Let's jump right into it. Now, if you've ever attempted using masking within Lightroom in the past, you've probably dealt with the pain that is trying to perfectly paint a mask over your subject without any bleed. Using this method, especially on multiple images, can be very time consuming. Instead, we now have these very nifty AI masks, which can auto detect your subject background, even the sky with a single click. I'm using the subject mask on this image to help pop the couple with a bump in exposure and a bit of contrast, along with pushing the temperature up a bit to give them nice golden skin tones. But let's say you wanted to save even more time. Archipelago, the awesome company bringing you this video, has been offering AI presets for a while now, giving you a variety of effects to choose from without the hassle of having to edit individual masks. In just this AI tool set alone, I have some great options for manipulating my subject with just a single click, and these can then be easily customized by using the preset amount slider. This keeps the busy work to a minimum so you can focus on creating. There's even a mist preset, which is very fun to use, adding that extra bit of spice to your work. Moving on to the AI sky mask, there have been so many times I can't even count when I lose detail in the sky after exposing for my subject. Again, trying to paint a mask with a brush is time consuming and frankly, kinda sucks. Using this tool, I can easily bring down the exposure a tad, add a bit of clarity, and lastly cool it down to bring out the blues. There are also some fantastic tools Archipelago offers that do this exact same thing for you. Oh, and they're free. That's right, free. Just sign up for the newsletter. Link above and in the comments. Moving on, let's take a look at the background mask. I'm sure by this point you get the picture. The AI intelligently detects our background and we make our adjustments from there. This is a great method to help bring out your subject from a relatively flat backdrop. And you can get creative from there. Play with different settings and see what you like. Archipelago offers a bunch of different background effects within different sets. I'll link those for you as well. Another masking tool to mention, and this one takes a bit more effort but still super easy, is the object mask. This is great if you have a random object, animal, building, thing, you name it. Simply draw around the perimeter of the object you'd like to affect and the AI does the rest. Lastly, and most recently released, is Lightroom's face and body detection. With this mask, you can single out specific features on your model. Eyes, skin, lips, teeth, hair, you name it. This one is seriously a game changer if you're a portrait photographer. Brighten eyes, warm up skin tones, the list goes on and on. Now over at Archipelago, we've taken full advantage of these features with some of our latest sets. The AI portrait tool set gives you over 30 presets to help edit your model to perfection. Each preset, a simple click, then adjust the amount slider. So go check it out if you like saving time and money. Link above. So I think it's obvious at this point, if you aren't using AI features in Lightroom, you're missing out. I hardly even use Photoshop anymore for most of my editing, and that alone is reason enough. I hope this video was helpful and informative. If you enjoyed it, please leave a like or consider subscribing if you haven't already. Also, please comment below if you have any questions, and see you next time.